Just before we get into this video guys, I just want to let you know that only 3.7% of you guys are actually subscribed. It only takes 2 seconds, just jump down into the description, chuck us a subscribe, it's free and you can unsubscribe at any point. Further ado guys, let's get into the video. Hello everybody, welcome back to another Baxter 012 gaming video. Today we're back with some more The Outer Worlds. It has been a fat minute since we've done a Outer Worlds video. But we're here, we're in the captain's quarters. Let's take a little look at his terminal. Yeah, whatever. We'll, uh, we'll get back to that. Make but yourself at home, Captain. Thank you, Ada. But yeah, we're back. Um, is there anything in here? Oh, I feel like there's, no, there's nothing in here. Okay, uh, let's just get back into it. So we've got to go somewhere, do something. It's, uh, ah, yes. We gotta, we're going somewhere. We are going somewhere, going somewhere. The groundbreaker? The groundbreaker loading docks. Oh shit, okay. Welcome to the system map. Arrived at the groundbreaker. Oh shit. Um. Guessing I can. Can we talk? Uh, sure. Hey, Captain. I heard that Groundbreaker's got a real good engineer. A lady named June Lay Tennyson? What about it? I was thinking that maybe I ought to meet her. If you got time to swing us by, I mean. I don't got much experience fixing actual spaceships. I bet you a can of Borston beans she could teach me all manner of stuff. Uh, sure. Thanks, Captain. I'll be sure to make it worth your time. Did you want to talk about something else? Absolutely not. I... Uh, yep, she's the only person I want to bring. Alrighty, so he is the unreliable here. Pravati is not with us. Oh well. Let's uh. Let's just get her gone. Customs and inspection, right this way. Okay. Hello. Identification, please. Captain Hawthorne, you said. Let me apologize in advance. I'm about to ruin your day. According to your ship's record, you've been flagged by the board. Your ship will be impounded until such a time as they see fit to lift it. You'll want to take it up with Udom Bedford, our board representative here on Groundbreaker. His office is located along the starboard wall of the promenade. God Shines sex. like a Byzantium commode. You can't miss it. Access to that information is above my pay grade, and I've turned down three promotions, so it stays that way. I shouldn't be mentioning it, but what the hell? This here, impounding your ship, it doesn't happen much. The board knows we don't take kindly to their interfering in our operations. If I had to take a guess as to why, you must have riled up someone important. You take the starch out of him, well, you won't hear any complaints from me. Oh, and if you're headed that way, would you mind doing me a favor? Sure. Wanda Dorset over in sick bay, tell her the shipment's not in yet. It's not coming in anytime soon. Why do I have so to do your to work? Off my ass about it. Much appreciated. Is there anything else I can help you with? No. Why do I have to do other people's shit? Like, why the hell can't you just do it yourself? I picked up this weird signal the other day. It was coming from Monarch. Here we go again. No one lives. This is obviously not the right door. Um. Do I have a big old map? Holy crap! There's so much. What the f- Oh my god, it's so big. I need to go up a level. Where the hell do I go up? That's security. 
Okay, this is gonna take a fat minute for us to figure out, guys, so... Apologies in advance. Buried. Okay. Backpack. Yeah, let's just take everything, boy. What do we have to lose? Is there, like, a door at the other end? That's something. Oh. Okay, um... Yeah, right. So I have to, like, try and find a way through? I guess? What's this? Use workbench. Ooh! Oh, I don't have anything at the moment. Okay. Can I jump up there? Can you allow me? Okay, maybe not. So... Is there like a different way... Out here? This place is confusing as hell. Alright, let's look at this. Okay, through here, this should be a door. Okay. I'm guessing, like, this is a huge ass door. This is a huge ass door, I'm gonna be so mad. I'll just go kill myself now. Bless my heart. A stranger come knocking on a poor old woman's door. You here for a particular reason? Or did the neighbors tell you how good my sugar cookies are? Sugar cookies? Made without a single natural ingredient. Or an oven. Just like store-bought. Those have been the height of illegality since Stellar Bay turned their noses up at the board. You and I could be thrown to the void just for discussing such a transaction. Lucky for us, Groundbreaker's a free port. We're outside of the board's control. For the time being, at least. Now, I only have the one nav key. And they're hard to come by these days. It won't be cheap. If you find yourself lacking in the bits, I might have an opportunity you'd be interested in. Well, I find I'm in need of a ship captain with a little more flexibility. Might oh, be this good. could help out the Groundbreaker, as well as earn some bits. But if you've got qualms... Do you know Edna over in engineering? Sweet as a pea, that one. On occasion, she'll pass along transmissions I might find interesting. She sent me a recording of a distress signal she'd scraped from the Groundbreaker's comm array. Curious thing is, it came from an outpost called Roseway, and Auntie Cleo abandoned that place years ago. Okay. You've got an ear for intrigue and a nose for bits. I like that. Here's a copy of the SOS recording, complete with the coordinates. If you should find a secret worth selling, might be I could find a buyer. Corporate bigwigs will pay top bit for inside information on their competitors. The more we got the corpse fighting each other, the less time they got to meddle in our affairs. Don't forget to come find old Gladys when you're done. Anytime, sweetheart. You know where to find me. Here, take a candy with you. Yes, the candy gives me power! <laughs> uh, I can't. <laughs> yeah, let's go into this. Um. <laughs> uh, engineering, we'll bump that up to. Um. One, oh, one for everything. Got two left. 
a bit more hand of melee and tech. Fly. No. X. Sure. Okay. All right. Wait, what? It's almost time for today's episode of The Chairman's Children. Care to listen with me? Yes, dearie? Take that darling ship of yours down to Roseway, where that distress signal I told you about came from, and ferret out some tasty corporate secrets for old Gladys. Shouldn't be too tough for a fellow like you, I'd think. Anytime, sweetheart. You know where to find me. So she's just gonna have that little thing on her head. Okay. I know she's in there, Emperor. Okay. Go back to Byzantium, you gold-plated bastards. Watch your profanity. This is Halcyon News. Ah, yes. Wheeler messaged me you were coming. He must be the captain of the Unreliable, a vessel that used to be helmed by one Alex Hawthorne. And you are not he. Has something happened to my favorite scruffy freelancer? Yes, yeah, good. Oh no, this is terrible. My dear friend, what devilry is this? In whose miserable fever dream am I trapped? Oh, Alex, there were so many arguments we'd yet to have. He was my God. dearest friend. I hate my conversations, friend. but it's the only thing you, you can do in this you game. You must know. That picture of us on the promenade, me hugging him, him wincing. I keep a copy beside my bed. Did he? Ah, sure. Oh, that's just like him. Such a sentimental man tell me how did he die i crushed him <laughs> uh, um trust me you don't want You're to quite right of course best not to pry into such dismal things right right you're going important places i'm sure big exciting important places <laughs> there i've removed the flag from your ship I'm terribly sorry for the inconvenience. Uh, however, before you go, Alex promised to tell me the location of Phineas Wells. I'm sure you've seen his wanted posters all over the colony. Did Alex tell you where Wells might be? Anything at all? You haven't read the posters? He's a terrorist, a thief, a madman. It's really in the colony's best interest that we stop him before he does further harm. Well, Alex knew, or he said he did, and you have his ship. Maybe he kept some records around, or a conveniently placed note on his bedside table. Um. Sure. What? Indeed. And you know where he is? Excelsior! An apprehension of this caliber will be tremendous for my career. I'll send you straight away to my superiors in Byzantium, only... Oh, la. Oh, no. Just a teensy one. The teensiest. Nothing to, uh, lie awake worrying about for nights on end or anything. <laughs> the thing is, I needed money. A lot of money, quickly, for reasons. God, uh... I might have pawned my official board seal to Gladys, the black market fence here on the Groundbreaker. I can't authorize the paperwork you'll need to turn Phineas in without it. It's only temporary, of course. I'd never leave something so important in the hands of someone of such a dubious moral character. I was going to buy it back once I raised the capital. So you'll need to get my seal back from her if you want to hand Phineas over to the board. Uh, 
though it might surprise you. I don't really think There's it would. No call for that kind of talk. No, I should apologize. I can't help being rather on edge. I really do need that seal, you see. Rather desperately. I can't okay, grant you I'll access to the Zantine without it. If the board learned of my foolishness, why... By the law, they... They'd fire me. I absolutely would not. The board isn't even the worst of it. Gladys intends to sell it to the highest bidder. She's demanded I provide her with proof of its authenticity. And if I refuse, she'll have those goons at Sublight Salvage throw me down the waste disposal shaft. Good. A spicy little pickle entirely of my own making. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much. I'm certain Gladys can be made... Well, can probably be made to see reason. <laughs> I'll be waiting eagerly for your return. Now, is there any way in which I might assist you? Nope. Oh, God. Okay. All right. Holy crap. So that's literally like 17 minutes worth of just talking to people. I'm actually. Oh my god! Now I gotta go talk to her again. Are you listening to me, Emperor? No one gives a shit, lady. Boom! Roasted. If you're here for this week's magazine club meeting, you're a touch late. Depends. What are you planning to do with it? See the lights. Taking a show or two at the infamous Bijou. Could be a treat if you like that kind of thing. All right, I'll sell it to you. But it's going to cost you dear. Anything else, dear? Anytime, sweetheart. You know where to find me. Okay. So. <laughs> Alrighty, 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 let's... Okay, quests. Okay, so I need to, like, I need to trade something with Gracious, that. I was just sitting down for tea. Want a charming copper kettle off that girl who runs the pub? She's a fierce arm wrestler. But she's no match for your pal Gladys. What's well, like expensive that I can? literally nothing okay um yeah this is where we're gonna leave this episode guys hope you enjoyed um this is a lot of talking in this episode um make sure you go down into the description and like and subscribe make sure you turn those bell notifications on so you know when i upload make sure you also go check out my facebook and instagram pages where i'll be posting more content like this on those pages make sure you also go check out my no walkers channel we'll be posting more content uh, very soon. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed and peace. I will stay.